what is up and good morning and welcome to the video everybody this is lionel and welcome to the first video in a series of 10 on how to start freelancing and this is from people who are self-taught and also for people who are in school to become to get a computer science degree anybody who wants to make money digitally basically we are going to take this industry by storm break into the industry the same way that i did i'm now reaching back and helping those slightly further uh behind me in the path a little bit of history on myself i'm a self-taught person who you know made it out the mud <laughs> on my own with nothing but mostly free youtube resources and now i'm teaching others to do the same i've been getting told that there's a lot of negativity out there in the industry about coding about artificial intelligence taking our jobs which i don't believe is true um i think that it would for sure be a different look but do i think that web developers and freelancers are not going to be needed no because when you think about it most of these people who own businesses are over 40 50 years old and they don't want to do these type of things on their own so this is the first in a series of 10 videos that i'm gonna put on the school and release them as you unlock this is for people who find us there before the youtube but if you're on the youtube then you know you get to see it anyway still join our school though because we have a lot more coming we're only just getting started so the first thing and most important thing is the ability to work every day now i'm not saying you have to go full on gary v but at least an honest 30 minutes a day needs to be set aside towards your freelancing and depending on what level of freelancing you are in that looks differently now if you're completely starting from scratch that means that 30 minutes a day you need to be working on your portfolio now what should you put in your portfolio if you're just getting started put build some stuff for yourself that you think is cool whether it's a 3js background or even just a template just a wordpress template single page just to show people that you can do that now step two is going to be how do you get your clients but step one, in order to get your clients, you need to have something to show people. People need to see that you are a motivated person who can solve problems, who can get things done. This is how we will get our clients to trust us. Because a lot of people who are starting businesses have too many things going on at once. They're wearing all sorts of different hats. So if they see this self-taught person arrive appear out of nowhere who's going to solve their problems and make their life easier it's a no-brainer for them so number one once again is the ability to do things every single day even when it's hard there's going to be easy days there's going to be medium days and there's going to be hard days the easy days you're going to work want to work anyway the hard days you need to push through and work on those days as well because that's the thing we're doing this this year 2024 we already have one month down we have 11 months to go we are going to get working to get active now time waits for no one we're not waiting for time the sooner you start working one thing you need to realize is that as soon as you start working on projects that you're creating as soon as you start coding now you're a developer they say fake it till you make it that's not faking it once you are coding once you're going to barnes and noble every day once you're going to the coffee shop once you're sitting in your office every day opening up your computer every day clocking in mentally turning off your phone ignoring social media for a little bit for 30 give yourself 30 minutes a day if you're just starting off and you're struggling with that okay the courses are super easy to follow we're still going to do courses because we still need to know the language and we need to be able to talk the talk and we need to be able to understand what the function is, what a loop is. If we're using React, we need to understand what a component is. But more important than that, we need to work apart from the course. We need to clock in and use our time 
to build ourselves every single day. A small amount of time every single day goes a long way. That's the first video. And thank you for following. Please like, share, and subscribe. This year, we're taking the industry by storm. Self-taught, as soon as people are quitting, we are not, you know, we're evolving with the times. We're using artificial intelligence and ourselves to make it happen, to make our dreams come true. Digital builders, we out. Peace.